Okay, so what the f did just happen? I just came home from this nail salon. This video is going to be uh, a story time video and this happened to me just 10 minutes ago. By the way, I have a new haircut. Do you like it? Or do you like it? Or do you like it? <laughs> I like it. It's. I wanted it to be short. Because um, it was very long and it was hard to, you know, keep it in shape. Okay, let's get into the crazy ass story that I'm going to tell you. I went to this nail salon. I booked an appointment at 6 p.m. Saying that I'm just going to do a manicure. They said they booked it for me. It's okay, come at 6, blah, blah, blah. I went there at 6. And I'm not really that kind of person who... Um, you know always goes to those places. I don't really have any experience. I've only been to a nail salon once Recently and I liked it. I didn't do any color or anything It's just you know cleaning and I liked how it looked because it looked different than how I do it because they take the dead skin around whatever and I wanted to do it again Because it was fun as well. They do like massage to your hand and put special creams. It smells really nice. I find the place I am getting ready to go in and there is, um, I see like three different men or four sitting um, they looked very busy, you know, they had customers just before I go in, this man closest to the door looked at me in the face but as soon as I went in he stopped um, looking at me so right in front of me there is this girl, okay <laughs> there is this girl looking at my face like this I'm not even exaggerating for probably like 40 seconds non-stop no stop she for a second she did not do look to the other side or something just full-on eye contact as soon as I appear on the door and Automatically, what would you think that is the person you speak to? Oh, I booked an appointment at 6 So after we had um, 40 seconds of eye, con eye contact I wasn't sure if that's the person or not because she wasn't speaking to me. She was just looking at me and I was like I didn't know what to say. I was like, hey, I booked a seat. Oh. <laughs> I said it like like a mouse because I wasn't sure and then she started laughing And then the her <laughs> and her friend was there sitting next to her. I think they were just drying their nails, and she wasn't the person. You know, she wasn't the person you have to speak to. I got so embarrassed. I was like, oh, <laughs> I was so confused. I was like, but why are you looking at me then? And I was like, but you didn't say anything. <laughs> Just looking at me, uh, and then she didn't say anything the whole time. She did not say anything, Shh, nothing. I think she said something like, <laughs> and she kept on looking at me every once in a while while I was sitting. Anyway, uh, the people who worked there, none of them um, approached to me. I sat there waiting because they were very busy. I didn't want to say anything. I waited, 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 waited. It's been 10 minutes. No speak, no one said anything, it's still busy. 20 minutes, no one said anything, still busy. 30 minutes, still busy. But I can, um, I could see the uh, man uh, looking at me every like five minutes, like looking at me, oh, he's waiting. Like from body language, I could tell that oh, they, they know I'm waiting, or oh, they know it's 6 p.m., I booked it, and it's busy, they're waiting for the customer to leave, so I, I go, okay. And then, after 30 minutes, um, two men, um, they weren't speaking uh, English or they were speaking on their own language. I, I don't think they knew English very well. They were talking, looking, and at the same time looking at me and they were like, blah, 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 manicure, blah, 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 and looking at me and, <laughs> and manicure, blah, 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 manicure, blah. Laughing, I was like laughing and laughing and laughing. I instantly 
I understood that they were laughing because I'm the, you know, I am a boy sitting there and everyone was a woman. Um, probably they were making fun that I am there. I don't know. There isn't proof of that, but they were laughing, saying manicure and looking at my face. Whatever. I said, okay, maybe, maybe they're not laughing at me. It's okay. Just carry on sitting and just do it. And then, look, um, the customers left, uh, most of them, and they were free. And I said, hey, uh, to the man, uh, what's going on? He said, hi, and he left. So, like, no one is talking, no one is saying anything. I even said, hey, you know, and no one said anything. Uh, I'm sitting there, it's 40, 40 minutes now. I'm getting a bit angry. And now there's only one customer left. And there are, there are like five people working there. And they weren't still approaching to me, okay, it's your turn. One lady that was staying there, she was giving me dirty looks. She was like this. She was like an old, old lady doing her nails. She was like... No, like it was, it was 100% like, no, it was more than that. It was like... Something like that. <laughs> and I've completely... Uh, what the hell was going on? This is the most awkward moment in my life. I went into a nail salon. I spoke with a stranger because she looked at me for 40 seconds in my eye. And then she didn't say anything, kept looking at me even though I spoke to her. And then these people who work there didn't say anything to me even though I said hey. And then the end of the story. Of course I left after 50 minutes because Two people came inside and they said, um, oh, we just booked for two people and then they started doing their nails and I was like, okay, bye. And I left. <laughs> so what the hell just did just happen? I don't even know. And then I went to another nail salon next to it. I said, hey, and all the eyes were on me like this. I don't know if they saw a man in a nail salon for the first time. <laughs> I do not know what if they did it on purpose. Even though they were free, they didn't do my nails. It made me wait for one hour. And then when the next customer came, they got them, but not me. But anyway, I guess I'll do my own nails because of this. <laughs> it's, not, it's not really a big deal anyway. Um, but I just wanted to share this because what the hell. Is this you know I had to I had to t tell you about this because I don't have friends to tell and you're my only friend if you have a uh, crazy nail stories like me let me know and I love you guys and be happy and I gotta go <laughs> How dare they can do this to me, huh? <laughs> they are so lucky I am not gonna tell their name to the world. Or should I? Ah, blah 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 blah, manicure. Ah, <laughs> blah 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 blah, manicure. <laughs> You are. <laughs> I lost 50 minutes of my life. Even though I booked. <laughs> I'm so angry right now. Sorry, guys. I don't want you to see me angry. Because I'm a very happy person normally. But sometimes. People drive me crazy.
And excuse for the um, messy house. I'm fucking off from this place. Um, there's any lights turning on in the bathroom and the living room. And the landlord decided to not to help me. No, seriously, um, my landlord is a jerk. Everyone can know. Um, I explained him, there are no lights, no lights are working, whatever the fuck I do. And he said, try new light bulbs. 